Welcome back, Crazy Deals and Steals family, and welcome newbies and new subscribers. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this CVS haul video for December 29th. Let me tell you first, I am not happy right now at all. Um, I had a, quite a few issues at CVS tonight, and one of the main issues with me and CVS is that I go to the store in the middle of the night so I can be the first one to bring you guys a haul video in the morning before you guys head to the store so you guys already know what the issues are, what to expect, all that kind of stuff. So when I do that, there's always seeming to be problems. And when there's problems, nobody's there to help with the issue because customer service isn't open um, over the phone. There's not a manager there in the store because it's the middle of the night. So when there is a problem, I can't get a hold of customer service and there's no manager to resolve the issue then and there. So then that creates even more of a problem because I either have to go back into the store later on in the week and get the issue resolved, which wastes my gas getting there because it's like 20 miles away. Um, um, or I got to sit on hold with customer service for an hour and a half and wait for them to resolve the issue. So that's, that's all around a problem. Okay. And then the next issue is that our digital manufacturer coupons that are supposed to be coming on Sundays, usually they don't get in our apps until about four or five o'clock in the morning. Um, so I usually have to sit around in CVS for a couple hours and wait for those to pop up so I can go ahead and check out, which is what I did tonight. And guess what? A $3 off tied 92 to 100 ounce digital coupon I thought we were getting we didn't get. So I wasted two and a half hours for no reason. Um, and I had to switch up my spend $30, get a $10 extra care book deal and some other stuff happened. So let's just get into it. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe now and give this video a big thumbs up for me. We're going to get into these transactions. I'm going to show you guys what happened and what went well. Okay, everybody, just a quick little overview of this tiny ass haul that I was not planning to do. I was planning to do some of these things like the finish and the, um, the air wake and the crest, but as far as the spend 30, get a $10 extra care buck, this was not my plan. I did not want to do this deal, and we're going to talk about what happened and what happened with some of these other things and coupons and extra care bucks not scanning and just, it was a mess at CVS. So by the time um, I had finished this dealio right here with these L'Oreal items, um, I said, you know what? Stuff's not working out for me tonight. Let me go ahead and leave because... I'm not going to keep giving CVS extra money and then waiting on hold with customer care for an hour and a half and waiting for them to return me my money in the means of extra care bucks. You know, I overpaid like $8 last weekend. I still have to get that back from them. I'm going to call them about that and this issue um, today here when I get done with these videos. So stay tuned. We're going to talk about everything right now. Okay, you guys, there is a deal too good for you to pass up um at cvs this, this week and one of those deals is the air wake and the finish okay these products are a mix and match with the lysol air wake and finish you can mix and match them they are three for ten dollars and fifty cents no extra bucks attached just three of them for ten dollars and fifty cents now we've got um paper coupons for these air wigs i believe in the 1215 smart source they are 50 percent off one coupons in that paper and they are a limit of two. So what I want you guys to do is grab two of these and one of these. And you're going to use a $1 paper coupon for this um, and a two of the Airwick coupons, the 50% off one Airwick coupons for these. These are a limit of two. So that's why I want you to get two of these and one of these. Now, if you have a $3 off 10 cleaning CRT like I did, you're out of pocket for these two items and one of these um, 14 count finishes is going to be $1 out of pocket for all of these items. That is a fabulous price, you guys. You cannot beat that, all right? I'm gonna show you guys my receipt real quick. I will tell you about a hiccup involving this. This coupon for these did not scan. And I actually tried to use the same coupon at Dollar General today on the trial size. It did not scan there either. So I was thinking, well, maybe it didn't scan because it's a trial size. However, it is not scanning. I also want you guys to print a 50 cent printable because those $1 coupons for these are also a limit of two. But you can print a 50 cent off one printable from finishdishwashing.com. And you can use two $1 if you want to grab three of these instead of no air wick. You can grab three of these, use a $1 for this, $1 for this, and then the 50 cent printable for the third one. And that would work out okay. 
However, they are not scanning, but if you have a manager at the store, they can push that through. Um, I went in the middle of the night. They can't do anything about anything like that. So I did pay an extra dollar out of pocket. I will get that back in the form of extra care bucks um, when I call customer care. So you see right here, these two coupons, $2.75, those are the 50% off coupons for the Airwick, all right? And then I had a $3 off 10 cleaning CRT. Like I said, the $1 finish coupon did not scan. I don't know why. So I should have paid um, $1 out of pocket, but instead I paid the two and nothing else. I paid a $2 extra buck for this and nothing else, okay? So even a good deal, even without that $1 coupon on there, two bucks for those three items, yes, that's a great deal. Um, now, let's talk about the next transaction and that is with let me get some of these things out of the way so you guys can know what i'm talking about a little bit better um so for the next transaction i did three of the finishes this is before i knew the coupon wasn't really working out for me i did three of the finishes and i also paired this in with the crest and the oral b why? Because I had a $10 care pass that I wanted to use, so I needed to boost up my total to around $10 or more so that I could use that and pay less out of pocket. Um, otherwise, you don't have to pair these together. You can do these separate than that, okay? So great, great deal on the mouthwash, even though one of my coupons did not come off for that. Actually, two. So with the Crest Whitening Mouthwash, they are $4.99, and when you buy one, you're going to get a $2 extra buck. Eh, sounds like a decent deal. However, if you have the right CRTs, this is a money maker for you. So um, the reason I didn't just get this is because I had a $3 off 12 oral care CRT as well. So these double to four pack Oral-B toothbrushes are buy one, get a $3 extra buck. So I paired this in with it as well. So I could use that $3 off 12 Oral Care CRT. These are $7.99 a piece. They did have different um, prices, but I needed to make sure and hit that $12 mark so I could use that CRT. Okay, so these two items together put me at $12.98. I stacked on that $3 off 12 Oral Care CRT. Everything was fine with that. I also used a $3 whitening, dental whitening CRT. It stacked on this just fine. No issues with that. I also had a $1 mouthwash CRT. It did not get put on there. It would not get attached. I don't know why. I'll have to call CVS about that. So now keep. let's keep a running tab of what CVS owes me. They owe me a dollar for these over here we just talked about. They owe me a dollar for the $1 CRT mouthwash. And I used a $1 manufacturer coupon from the 1229 PNG for the Oral-B toothbrushes. Didn't scan. So they owe me another dollar for that. That's three bucks we're at right now for everything so far. And I also used a $1 Crest mouthwash coupon from the 1229 PNG. It came off fine, no issues. And then we talked about the finish over here. Um, now, regarding these finishes over here, um, two of the finish coupons scanned one would i had the 50 cent would not so it did let me scan on this transaction a one dollar uh paper coupon for this a one dollar paper coupon for this and then i tried to stack on that 50 cent printable it would not scan so just all kinds of problems with the finish coupons um and i will call finish and complain about this actually so let's look at the receipt and i also paired in with this a three dollar off 10 oral or um cleaning crt so i use a three off 10 cleaning crt a three off 12 oral care crt um and then i put my ten dollar care pass on here with those other coupons i just mentioned and i only paid a dollar and fifty cents out of pocket for everything and i got back um five dollars in extra care bucks two for the mouthwash and three for the Oral-B. <clears throat> My out-of-pocket should have been $2 less. So I should have actually only paid about $9, including tax out-of-pocket and gotten back $5 in extra care bucks, um, which would have made all these items four bucks, which is a great price because look at, I mean, look what we've got here. Um, so now we are up to 
let's see, $4. CVS owes me $4 so far. Now on for the kicker, okay? Now, next. This was what I paired for the spend 30, get a $10 extra buck. This is not what I wanted to get. I wanted to get that 92 to 100 ounce tie. That's what I would suggest you guys get if you have the $3 off tied manufacturer coupon. And as you see in the ad, I believe if I'm not mistaken, this right here means you're gonna get a digital for this, correct? Or am I wrong? Or does that mean clip it out of the paper or what? I was assuming that this meant we were gonna get a digital for this because we got a lot of other digital PNG coupons that popped up in our CVS app um, early this morning. So I would definitely check those out. Awesome Febreze coupon popped up, you guys. Um, okay, so <clears throat> these items right here, let me flip my page over here real quick. I got so many notes written everywhere, all over everything. Okay, so these items right here. Now, this was done with my regular CVS account, not my new account. So on my regular CVS account, the instant coupons do not print for some reason. So I was unable to use a $3 instant coupon for this L'Oreal stuff. And I was really kind of ticked off about it. Um, like I said, I was planning to get the Tide deal with a couple other things, but that Tide digital did not come on there and I don't get Tide coupons in my PNG insert. So I was just, I waited in the store, you guys, for over two and a half hours for those digitals to pop up and I didn't get a Tide coupon. So I tried to rush and put something else together. This is still a decent deal, but not the deal that I wanted to do. And you know, you, when you guys get excited about doing a deal and then you can't do it, it's just, it's, it's upsetting. So, um... All right, let me show you guys my receipt. This is kind of a high ticket item. This is $19.49. And then these are $4.99 a piece. Um, I used one manufacturer coupon that was clipped on my CVS account. And that was $2 off L'Oreal Facial Care um, digital manufacturer coupon. So I used that. And then I used a $7 off L'Oreal Paris um facial moisturizer so that attached to this and then i used a six dollar off 25 dollar l'oreal paris crt that attached just fine <clears throat> and what really kind of irked me to the core this will track for beauty as well so these are going to end up being free um, after beauty bucks but what irked me to the core for this is that i had a ten dollar extra care buck that i wanted to use to pay down my out of pocket and it wouldn't scan i don't know why it just the screen was like blank like it wouldn't scan and they wouldn't work with me they wouldn't do anything about it um so now i was unable to use that ten dollar extra care buck and instead i'll show you i had to use a three dollar extra care buck and a two dollar extra care buck and then I had to pay this cash out of pocket. And I really didn't want to because you guys know I don't have a lot of extra money right now. So I'm upset because now I've got like a wasted $10 extra care book. I got to call CVS about that. So now we're up to CVS um, owing me $13. $10 extra care book and then the three $1. And this was the last transaction I did. And when that $10 extra care book would not scan, they wouldn't do anything with it. I said, you know what? It's my time to leave CVS because... Um, yeah, I shouldn't have to spend an hour or an hour and a half on the phone with customer care because they can't help with these issues in the store. That's not fair to the customer. There should be a resolution for something like this in the store, right? In my opinion, that's how I feel. Let me know in the comments if you feel different. Um, but yeah, this concludes my little tiny petty CVS haul. I may try and go back to CVS and grab everything else I was going to get later on in the week, depending on how I feel. You know, I've not been having a very good month, um, so I'm ready for January. I'm ready for the new year to start, you guys. So let me know in the comments what you guys plan to get at CVS. Um, let me know about that spend 30, get a $10 extra care buck. What are you guys going to do? I really wanted to grab that tie, you guys. And... Um, yeah, I didn't get that digital coupon. So bummer, bummer. Um, but yeah, let me know how your day is going so far. And let me know also that you are subscribed. If you subscribe and you're a newbie, let me know in the comments, please. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up for me also. 
All right, my crazy deals and steals family, if you have not already subscribed, be sure to go ahead and do that so you can be entered into win that next gift card giveaway at that 4,000 subscriber mark. Go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up for me if you can and let me know um, what you guys plan to get at CVS this weekend. If you plan to get anything at all, I would suggest you guys go. Even though I had issues, I would suggest you guys go. It's a great weekend to shop at CVS. I do plan to try and do a midweek haul sometime this week, and I'll keep you guys updated on that. Also, if you guys could show me just some regular love in the comments as I've been having a shitty-ass December, I would greatly appreciate that. And be sure to check out the Walgreens haul. I got 20 gift sets. I spent like 10 bucks of my own money. Um, I got some body wash. I got all kinds of great stuff. And then if you need to see the deals and how to break these deals down, check out the CVS deals video or the Walgreens. Green Seals video. All of these will be linked somewhere right here on the green screen, or of course, you can go to my video list on the channel. And I will talk to y'all later. Bye.